It has been 10 years since the Sunrise propane explosion rocked this North York neighborhood, and even now the site here remains unused, overgrown. However, the wheels are in motion to redevelop the property that has residents here excited, but ultimately thinking about their safety once again. A decade after flames lit up the night sky and smoke choked out the stars, the memories of the sunrise propane explosion linger. Retired City News cameraman Pedro Zuquette captured these iconic images. He was one of the first on scene that night. I look towards the east and I see this huge um, orange glow in the sky and I go, okay, this is a big one. Oh my gosh. The pain leak from a hose failure during an illegal truck to truck transfer sent fireballs into the sky. The blast forced about 12,000 residents from their homes and killed two people veteran firefighter Bob Leak and Sunrise employee Singh Saini. And I started shooting, and every single explosion of the small propane, uh, I could feel it like my chest would, would uh, just. It was scary. A number of homes were destroyed or damaged, like Mario Iaboni's. Yeah, then it, you, you, I told you that the, all of the siding down, the window all moved, the floor cracked, they, they put the new paint, new insulation on the top, everything. The one that we ended up recommending to city council was the mixed use. A decade later, the city is finally ready for the site's redevelopment. A park townhouses, generally a you know, low, lower form residential, and then uh, mixed use allow, would allow for an office complex or could allow for uh, apartment buildings within, the, within that area. However, the landowners are appealing council's decision on what should go into the site. They reportedly want more density and higher buildings. Holy Oh my God. It felt and sounded like uh, war because, you know, there were explosions all over the place. For Zuquette, he's excited for what will go in Sunrise's place in the future, but admits the past still haunts him. The only thing that really uh, affected me uh, from that uh, explosion was the, uh, the woman who, uh, who died of a heart attack because she was a friend. Uh, um, so that one uh, still hurts. As for when this site will be redeveloped, I'm being told that it is at least another year to two away. Amanda Ferguson, City News.